Hello and welcome to my vlog. This is your friendly neighborhood old bat talking from her uh, current position in her flea market booth. Not much going on right now as per the usual. Hello. Uh, and right now I'm making earrings. It's a very simple process really. Just open up the end, pull the ball back. Open the end, like so, open it a little more, put the little pumpkin in there, see the little pumpkin. And put the, hang the little pumpkin. Now I'm on camera. The, the biggest hole. See how it's dangling? and close it up. You got a set. Alright. I'll show you how to make a set like this. It's a little, a little easier. I've got these little balls. Let's see, they got little flowers in them. I'll make a couple of these too. These will be good in the spring. I can always put them up this spring. I thought I'd do a little positive content today, rather than being a negative Nancy. Oh, that's the wrong color. Yeah, they've got little, little crystals and little flowers in them. And see, I'll pull the bat, this this little ball here. See this little this little ball. Pull that ball back. Make sure that you can open it so you can. You could open this little hoop. Well, these are gold, so I need to get a gold one. And it's the same process, regardless of the color. Pull the ball back. Open it up like I just did there. Put it in and close it back up. And you have an earring. These are really simple to make. You can make these yourself.
Put it in. The chances are everything I like my mother. And you got it down another with a little earring. Now you have a set. It's really easy. You can always order your uh, findings on Amazon. Order them in bulk and make just about anything to uh, go with your outfits, go with your mood, or as an outlet for your, for you know, your creativity. You can just let your imagination go with this sort of thing. That's nice. And, That's nice. you know, it's something that I enjoy. There she is. Hi. Hi. It's where comes one of my friends. <laughs> Hi. Um, you don't mind being in a YouTube video, do you? I don't mind. All right. This is my friend. Say hi, friend. Hi. How are you guys doing? Yes, I actually know people IRL, and I touch grass. Yay. How you doing? I'm doing good. Hug, hug, hug. So what you been up to? Nothing. Well, I'm doing a lot of cleaning in my basement, my uh -huh. studio, and I'm very happy. It's starting to look like something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're and looking as as, good. Thanks. As soon as I get the TV in there, nobody will ever see me again. Oh, wow. Yeah, I know how that is. I've got my nine sewing machines. I'm ready to go. <laughs> so are you here as a pay, as a, as a purveyor of goods or as a, as a, as a uh, consumer? Maybe a little of both because he asked me to come in. He might need me to sit. You okay. Know, he gets a plumbing job. So, okay. Yeah. All right. I'll be back. I'll, I'll be over and talk to you in a bit. Okay. It's always good to see a friend. Oh. <sighs> Well, where were we? Yeah, we were we were making stuff. Okay, and then there's an option where you can use a jump ring to make it dangle a little bit more. And I'll show you what I mean. All right, let's get something fun. Now, these have been pretty good sellers. People have liked these. And I'll just go ahead and grab one at random. These are in the shape of snack foods. This is these are bugles. <laughs> these are kind of cool, and uh, people like these. And uh, I'm gonna show you how to use a jump ring to attach them. All right, so you get a little jump ring, which is one of these little ringy dings here. A ring. Maybe I better do it like this. And you can see it. It fell down towards my hand, finger. Like that. Let's see if I can hold it between my fingers. Like that. That's a jump ring. Okay, you spread it out a little bit. And you put your, your finding in it. Huh? I didn't say nothing. Oh, I thought you were talking to me. No, I was talking to Andy. Thought my husband was talking to me for a minute. Are you talking to somebody or something? Um, I'm making a YouTube video. Oh. Okay. I'll have a with that. Get back to what I was doing, yeah? And then you take... And you close the jump ring with your pliers. There's a special set of pliers that you use, but 
I don't use them. I'm really supposed to, but I don't. Get them closed, closed off. And even. And make sure that it won't slip off of the, off of it. All right, that looks like it's pretty good. And. This one looks pretty good. It's not gonna slip off. Can you see how it dangles a little bit more? And I put it on backwards, of course. But there's a way to fix that. No, actually it's hang, hanging to the side. Which is why, you, why I don't put jump rings on them. But that's the way you do it if you've got something that's round or you got a, another specific kind of bead that, you know, does, it's like 360. I'm going to take that apart. And that just flipped. And I'm going to go ahead and put these on a card. These can be sold. And i got to be careful with these because these are glass. These, these here. Hi there. How y'all doing today? Doing just fine. Is there anything I can show you? No, we're getting Okay, well, y'all have a good day. You too. All right, well, that's about all I got for right now. Um, Later on in the day, I'll show y'all how to make a necklace. So, y'all take care, and y'all have a great day. See you in a few. Bye.